Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to some more Lathe. Oh, the day I've had, I feel like Lathe is the last game I should play, but we're gonna play it anyway. Anyway, we got put in prison, uh, which, I mean, all things considered with my psychic powers, is probably the least safe place you could put me. Uh, I have psychic abilities, it's just not gonna keep me there for very long, but hey, if they wanna try, they're more than welcome to try. Uh, and that's exactly what they did. They tried. Um, let's make sure we search everything and make sure everything's good. They have eyes that pierce this flesh of mine from every corner of this room. Do they think I cannot see? They're wrong. Hello? Every corner of the room, eh? I don't see anything in there. Is this a body part? Hello? Okay, you... You go... You go ahead and you just stay in there, ghost. That's fine. Wait, there's... That's my jail cell. It's a little dark and a little disorienting. Uh, blood spatter on the walls at this point in time doesn't bother me. Could be worse. Could be the monster hunting me down. It's actually fucking hard to see anything in here, though. Just gonna eat up. Ah, here we go. A little something something. Um, we'll go ahead and hit R, grab that. My precious room is gone, it has been taken from me. I knew every single stone by name, and now all of my beloved friends are gone. Today will once again be the first. Wait, today will once again be the first? Is this another test, I wonder? I suspect the guards know, but they never speak. Their footsteps tell their stories, but I need more practice. They haven't noticed yet, but I have. Something feels different in this cell. We have been transferred, no doubt, but there is something else too. Oh, so maybe like... They were transferred to a different cell, like, unconscious or something, and they're not supposed to know. And it looked like maybe it was something down there, but no. Alright. Alright, I guess we're going this way. Hey! Hello? No, no, don't make moaning noises. I'm a busy man, and I don't have time to listen to you moaning. No. Hello? I'm just gonna break stuff so it's not in the way. It's a big room, man. You got a big old room going there. I can't take that. Alright, let's just get rid of... Let's get... Get rid of it! Good enough! Lodge it in there. And we're fully healed and we're good to go, man. Alright. I don't see anything else in here, though I am freaking terrified. Don't make noise, game! It's freaking annoying when you do that. Is there like a lever? Um, hmm. This is my cell. I don't know where to go. This way? Have I not gone this way? Okay, well, maybe this is the right way. Aha! A letter. Perfect. One day, the boon came to me at last. A fresh bed with white, clean sheets! I felt so light, almost as if I were flying. At last, my transformation is complete. What transformation are you flicking, flacking, talking about, fam? I don't understand. It's like a double wide cell. Uh... Huh? I locked myself in? Alright, yeah, that's fine. I love it when I lock myself in a cell. It's my preferred way to travel. Lo locking myself in a cell. Huh? This is a puzzle of some sort, clearly. Oh, I'm in a new area, I think. It's really, really, really dark. Alright, looks like we got somewhere to go over here. Okay, we can definitely pop through that. Before we do that, let's, like, read. And see what else is happening on this end. Uh, the smell of burning incense made my blood run cold. I could hear two or three men laughing and cursing. I worried less about the first two, but Jacob? 
I had seen him hunting prey, ripping off limbs with his bare hands if he was drawing pleasure from it. I walked around the house following the sound from the from their footsteps. What house? Peeking over the edges of the kitchen window, I thought maybe I could trick them somehow, perhaps make some noise and lead them to the front door so she could jump through the window and escape, but I was too late. That makes no sense to me, but that's okay. I don't know what that did. But we're gonna just go ahead and bust these things open. Wait, what? Uh... Alright, well, can I throw some things at it? Come on. No? Well, if there's a monster around, dude knows I'm here. Uh, I'm making a heck of a lot of noise. So I pulled the switch. There's like a place to go there. I don't understand why they would let me bust that, that stuff down if I can't go through it. Looks like once the switch is pulled, there's nothing more I can do. Alright. We gotta go back. Or not. What? Oh, Jesus Christ! Uh, there's a way up, apparently. And that's probably where I need to go. I jumped because there's a body hanging up there and I didn't realize it. Right? I can't click that. I'm gonna have to mess with the physics and play with the physics puzzles. I don't want to do that. That seems not at all fun. But it's probably what I have to do. Oh god. Alright, it's gonna be one of these. Uh, um, here. Right? Like, is this what I'm gonna have to do? Maybe not. Maybe it's just this up there. Here, gimme. I don't know. Like, this looks like something you would want to rotate. Oh, maybe a rock? Maybe I need to throw a rock through this stuff? Really? That's what I needed to do? That is really, really dumb. All this time, I didn't think that's what I needed to do, but I actually did. And now I need to go under the water. All right, we're in the water. Hello. Anything down here? No? Some poison mushroom stuff. Can I see? Can I go over here? Like under the water maybe? No? Alright, let's get the hell out. Oh my god. The most noise ever made by a single man right here. Alright, no bodies. At least there was like a secret up there. I wasn't like completely thrown off. Like it wasn't completely pointless. I do not want to pull that lever quite yet. We have been cast into eternal darkness, for it is our fate to carry this burden. Shadows grow in, the, in our finite minds, haunted by our guilt, and yet we chant with heavy breaths. The fabric of life being stretched out far and wide from this place. The weeping of its threads piercing my ears right before they break into a thousand stars. This is the mockery of the gods. Sure, man. It's a mockery of whatever you want. You keep on thinking real deep like that. Maybe I need to pop this. It did nothing, okay? Saving. It's a campfire. Let's see what's up here. Oh, did you hear that? It's a creature out there somewhere. Bear traps? And a ball of hay? Damned rodents, they keep coming back however many traps I place. Something draws them to this place. I wonder what it could be. A ball of hay. Is that something I like? Huh. My immediate thought is, catch it fire, if I can. Ooh. 
She sat on her favorite chair as one of the men kept twisting her arm, almost as if he was enjoying her screams, and it looked like he wanted more. Jacob pushed her head down firmly on the table and ordered the third man to pull out the last of the boxes of incense. I couldn't really tell if they used it for their ritual or just to mask their own stench. He grabbed her hair and pulled her ba head back and said, almost whispering, it's time. I could see that she tried hard to hold it in, but the awful smell was the final drop. Nausea took over her body and fluid sprung out of her mouth and nose. With each cough, she struggled for air. Then, she, then finally, finally, he violently smashed her face into the table twice. No human being should be capable of committing such an atrocious act, yet that was exactly what I witnessed. An otherworldly scream escaped her crimson lips while he was holding the back of her ne neck like a captured animal. Awesome. This is just the most pleasant of things. There's another one over here. Did you hear that? I heard walking, and I don't know if it was me. Bodies hanging out. Good. No, I'm cool with just bodies everywhere. And by cool with it, I mean no. All right, so the only thing I can do... Did I even get it to light on fire? I can. All right, let me guess. Light the bramble on fire. Yup. Easy enough. Burn away! Plant thickness! Be gone! This is where I came from, right? Pretty sure. Yeah. Alright, are we done? Do we need to douse it or something? Nope. No, oh, Jesus. Okay. No, it just took time. Get this thing out. I don't want to burn myself. But I'm going through. Move, motherfucker. I don't like that at all, but I had to do it. Here, give me this. More psychic juice. Hello? Move. Move, barrel. Sometimes you move, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you feel like a nut. Sometimes you don't. Wait, wait. Why am I? No, get off this thing. I want to explore first. Burning body. I didn't do that. Save point. Yeah, okay. I hear you. What the hell is that noise? Hey! Trap. Beautiful. Oh, nice. Hello? Okay, hang on. Okay. I saw an empty one over here, so I'm gonna go ahead and replace it. I don't know if it actually matters, but I'm gonna do it. Because it, it's giving power. Listen, before you freak out, monster, if you exist, let me just save it real quick. I was naive back then. Her husband Jacob was ferocious compared. But the fool, but foolish as I was, I kept pushing my luck. The man was, was of great influence on the village. Silent Whispers described him as a merciless man. We had no other choice but to have our meetings in utmost secrecy. But I ju it just wasn't enough. Our hearts kept longing for more, so we became lovers. <gasps> dirty, dirty lovers. Gross. All right. So the power like let me open this door? No. Well, then I have to go. Uh, oh wait. Ah, okay. That didn't open that door, but it lets me go back. Ow! Burned myself on the torch in the middle of the sky, I guess. All right, we have to go up that ladder. Yeah, this one. The one I got attached to. All right, let's see what's up here. Hello, my darling. Hello, my baby. Hello, my ragtime gal. All right. I don't see shit. Hang on. Nope, can't turn that on. I should just break these. Because having them just lying around feels like a mistake. Books? He gave us ink and paper to record his work. How kind of him. I kept smiling every day to show him my devotion. That's all that he desired from us, but no one understood. I knew all along in the end he only wanted us cured. 
Okay. You guys are all too hopeful that this guy isn't just being a freaking dickhole. I feel like I missed something over here. Oh! God. Damn it. Don't do that. Fucking bear traps. That's the first one I haven't really seen. Okay, locked. So I can't go through here? Alright, never mind. I have to go this way. It's fine, I just... I thought there was more. Alright, we've got like 30 minutes on the camera battery. Hello? Wait, what? Did I go in a circle? Uh, okay. Did I miss something? Did I go in a circle? Did I do all of that to... To do something? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Ah! Okay, all of that to turn this on, I think. Okay, that's fine. I am nervous as hell. There's an exit there. What? Oh. Okay. Oh, save spot. Okay, interesting. No. No, 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 no. We're gonna run away. Hey, we're gonna run today. Hey, we're getting chased by. Hey, a monster. Hey, oh, you are shitting my hole. Hello? Oh, fuck. Oh. Fuck. Oh, 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 I think I heard a door. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Get me out, fam. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. There's a door. It's locked right there. Oh, hey. Okay. There's no way. There's no way this is gone. Uh, this, yep. Nope. I had a feeling. There is no way they were going to give me the exit. <sighs> No way in hell. That's a lot of body parts. Hello? Hello? You know what? I'm just gonna keep that shit closed. Oh, I really like bones. Oh, ow! Fuck! Goddamn fire! Oh, is this the other side of the door that I saw? Or not? The disfigured man carried me all the way down here and locked me up inside that filthy old cell. Was I supposed to wait for someone? I should have left the island when I had the chance. No shit, Sherlock! No shit, you should have left the island when you had a chance. Oh, God. Hello, bones everywhere. Man, I should have gotten out of here when shit got weird, you know? But I just, I was, I was too curious for my own good. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm saying this is a good place to stop the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll pick it up from here tomorrow. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.